So I want to illustrate how you can use the Live Paint Bucket tool to easily fill areas with color. So I'm going to get out my Live Paint Bucket tool and click first on the lower left hand swatch. And you'll notice as I arrow through the, the colors in the swatches panel, the little cursor, uh, the little heads up display above the cursor will change. I can go up and down and just cursor through all the different colors in my swatches panel. And that's why it was so important earlier to set up these color groups so that we could more easily have all these different colors organized and uh, scroll through them. So now I'm in the lower left hand swatch in the, the bottom most color group. So I'm going to start uh, I'm going to start painting. I'm going to make sure that I have this all selected first uh, and then um, make a live paint group and you'll see the little the little message there click to make live paint group. So I'm going to click on it and now uh, choose the color that I want the uh, lower left hand one and I'm going to click first in the lower um, the bottom most triangle and then I'm going to arrow to the right once and click in the next triangle and arrow to the right one more time and click in the next triangle and I'm just going to keep clicking oh, I missed one, there we go and keep clicking into each one of the triangles and if I've done it correctly then I should have used up all 10 swatches in the first color group and I did. So now I'm going to go up, uh, arrow up once and just um, keep arrowing and clicking into each one of these triangles. Well, and you'll see that I, uh, I screwed up a bit so let me let me restart here at this one. And when you're doing live paint, the area that you're going to be painting will actually be highlighted in a red.